I tried to warn you all that the AMC photo from Reddit was a fake. Yet, I had so many call me a liar based on the facts that those online trailer release dates are legit. Yet, I made it perfectly clear that online trailer release dates and theatrical dates are two totally different things. Now, what sense does it make for studios to send to theaters the online release dates when it has nothing to do with the, the uh, theatrical? What fucking sense does that make? So, when I went to confront those who tried to call me out on it, the comments were already deleted. I wonder why. Jeez, is it because we didn't get a fucking trailer? Now, the question is, where did the release dates of June 1st and June 10th come from? Was it actually from sources, or were they just assumptions? Because you have people with huge followings, blue check marks, claiming 100% between those two different dates that the teaser trailer was going to be released on those days. But guess what? They were wrong! Not only that, but they didn't really bother to admit that they were completely wrong and keep making excuses that their sources got the release dates wrong. Or, this is even better, because Sony Pictures found out that everyone was expecting it. So you know what they did? They changed their whole plan for worldwide release because it got leaked out. The dates got leaked out. We can't do it. Pick another date. Are you fucking kidding me right now? You think they give a rat's ass? The worst part is that those that are gullible enough to believe them to begin with are actually believing their bullshit and still depending on them for information. Do yourselves a favor. If you're going to continue to keep buying their bullshit, please hang yourselves with a fucking cordless phone because at this point you honestly deserve to be trolled. Don't you get it? Their only motive is to get clicks and followers and it's working, especially since they have blue check marks, which at this point proves that even these people aren't reliable. Yet, I guess people feel secure on trusting them for, for basically false information, empty promises followed by runarounds and bullshit fucking excuses. Look, this is the truth. These people are 100% full of fucking shit. Let's get real here for a moment. The main reasons as to why people assumed, yeah, A-S-S, -S, asses, that the trailer was going to be released on June 1st was because it was Tom Holland's birthday. Simply because Marvel Studios released the Shang-Chi trailer on Simu's birthday. Yet people seem to forget that Sony Pictures is in charge of distributing the film, not Marvel Studios. People assumed that the trailer would be released on June 10th because of Sony Pictures' um, Peter Rabbit sequel that was coming out this weekend. Whatever sources they claim to have had is just as reliable as a tinfoil fucking hat. Because truth be told, okay, this is coming from me. I've been doing this for a long time. Listen very closely. Sony Pictures was never going to release the trailer on those dates, period. And don't say I didn't try to warn you on more than one occasion here. I honestly was not even going to get involved in the first place. Until people kept asking me if these rumors were true. And you know, usually I ignore it. And it just pissed me off that these people with blue fucking check marks were flat out fucking lying to the people. And then making lame excuses. And these fucking sheep keep buying their fucking bullshit. Look, this is why I decided to do this YouTube channel in the first place. Because of people like this. You have these fans who really want legit information. I'm just so sick and fucking tired of these trolls. Trolling fans who just want to know what the truth is. I bet you that the person who created that fake AMC photo on Reddit had a fucking blast when he literally tricked everyone into thinking that it was real. 
Yet every manager I confronted at AMC from three different locations confirmed that they have never seen an image like that and confirmed that they were fakes. As well as constantly confirming that they have not received the teaser trailer, um, which I feel bad that I have to keep asking them and I'm tired of doing it. Listen, honestly, there is no reason to obsess of a teaser trailer because they never reveal too much and it's just a taste of what's to come. And I have an update on when we can expect a first and second trailer, which reveals a lot more and what you all should be really excited about. Yes, the teaser trailer will break the internet and coming real soon. But get ready for man babies to cry about how they didn't reveal too much and how short it was, yet clearly they have no idea on the concept of what a teaser is. So, here's when we can expect that first trailer. Thanks, the tiger, you just hit the jackpot. Woo